All right, guys, so today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how I clean all the Waterbury Patriots equipment. So, yeah, let's go on the journey. So what I was doing right here is this is a mixture of bleach and water and I'm just because my dad's the equipment manager and you know we just took all the pads back to our house you know he's the equipment manager you guys can't even see me let's get down here all right so yeah well we're just rinsing this off and it's important to rinse it off because or in the beginning of the year due to you don't know who's had it before you and you don't know how bad if they never clean their pads or if they like sweat way too much um and sweating could lead to like ringworm because if you don't take a shower um, if you don't disinfect your pads which i do after each practice so this is what we're doing right now is kind of like you know for your hair like a deep conditioning this is like a deep moisturizing i guess like you're not really moisturizing anything but a deep cleaning and this is just getting the pads right and after each practice i highly advise you guys like get some spray disinfectant spray or wipes wipe down your helmet inside your pads because yeah you can get some really bad like diseases or infections and I can say one time, I think my first year of football, that, yeah, okay. My first year of football, I did not wipe down my chin guard and I broke out on my chin and it was really bad. It was like scabbing and stuff. But no, it's gotten a little better due to me. Just keep on cleaning my pads. So right now what we're about to do is after five minutes or so, which it's been five minutes, we're just gonna wipe down all the bleach and water that's been on these pads right here behind me. And yeah, we are just going to repeat the process so i'll get back to you when it's halfway done i'm gonna just show you guys me rinsing off at least one pad and now the air tank ran ran out for the compressed air in this case bleach on water and basically what you do is you do this there's a little nozzle here so you twist it to the left until all the air comes out but i already did that all the air already came out and uh <clears throat> oh my God, I to some air. and now down here you're just gonna want twist it off then you're gonna be left with this and now it's um so on the side over here it says something about two gallons i'm gonna fill it all the way up to two gallons and then i'm gonna put 24 ounces of bleach in here you know this is the same thing i'm gonna just pour it in so yeah i'm gonna hit you up when i'm about to put the water in all right guys so now we have the hose right here and we're just gonna fill it to two gallons which is Right about here. Yeah, that's about two gallons now. We got the bleach. Now we're just gonna put like 12 ounces of bleach in here. And then we're gonna pump it up. Got that done. Now we just put the bleach in here. And then it's gonna be a little foamy. And like I said earlier, there's a valve here, so you're gonna wanna tighten it so not all the air goes to waste. You twist it back on. And then you just pump. And that's basically it. And yeah, catch you next, bro. This is a weird angle. Let me. Okay, I'm on.
All right, guys, so that's how I clean the pads for the entire team. But if it's myself, um, what I'd normally do after each practice was grab some mixture like Clorox and water or disinfectant, disinfectant spray. I spray my helmet and my shoulder pads. And the reason we do the deep cleaning is to maintain the pads, make sure they're like relatively clean for the year to come. So, yeah. All right, guys, so that's how I clean all the shoulder pads. Um, there are over like 70 of them. And I just want to know, how do you guys clean your shoulder pads? Do you do what I do or something similar to that? Like you do like a hardcore like treatment for it or do you just like rinse it off and whatever? I like to know. And also, I got to know, who is a Cleveland Browns fan down below? Is it because of Odell? I don't know, man. <laughs> I just want to know. All right, peace.